Hello and welcome to Easy Billing System. Now we have added lot of features in this system. We have added GST. We have added uh, PDF generation of the bill, bulk PDF generation, etc., etc. So let's start this Easy Billing System, and you will see how it works. For creation a new invoice just hit a new invoice so this is a new look and feel of uh, invoice template you can see so you can put your invoice uh, or whatever your header your company name here your all address and all basic details this is your uh, this tin number CST pan number service tax number you can uh, align here you can configure uh, accordingly and this is the party name this is payment mode and this is all see this is same like before but the new GST column is inserted here and this is the GST amount and this is the footer section you will have all necessary things over here free charges discount round off so now I will show you how you can create the invoice. To create the invoice, you just double click on this. You you will have this menu first of all. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine options are here. So I start with new invoice. To create the new invoice, just double hit and double click on new invoice cell. So it will reset the template and it's you will have a one pop-up message ready for new invoice just press ok then it will ask system will ask you in which mode you are to create this invoice I select check once you select the check the bank name uh, zoom window let's say I just select any bank you can select the bank we have some banks like this I just said Indian overseas bank once I select the bank it will ask for the uh, check number because I am taking this uh, I am taking this invoice in the form of check so check number is uh, required I am just giving the check number after giving the check number it asks for the party name so I'm just look for the party name let's say I select this party name and after selecting the party name see all are coming here all information are automatically filled and then same like before this is product window you can select the product select the quantity enter again select the product quantity let's say this time selecting life boy so you can select see you will have the stock as well you can see in the window and selling price of the product so I just select this three again nice choose some another item this this quantity and just escape to uh, disappear the window to just uh, hide the product window you just press uh, escape key if you again uh, invoke the product key uh, this uh, product zoom you just press control Q shortcut key this is shortcut key and again just press escape it will disappear and uh, suppose you want to modify these products you don't want this product actually by mistake only you have added so you just select this cell and just press delete and again invoke the same product window 
I just select this. Now I'm updating this product. So this, let's say two. So you will have this. See automatically it identify where is the blank cell and it will insert. So in this way you can take the all products. And here if you want to change the quantity, you can change after the. I, even after you uh, uh, issued already quantity but you want to change again you can check here you can check here so this way you can change and just go down you will have this option free charges suppose if it is free charges applicable then just uh, click here free charges so it will pop up another small window we just put the value over here and then just as uh, enter key again if you want to change so you do, you cannot change from here you cannot change all locked only you have to select this free charges again and uh, if uh, you want to change and just make it again another value and press enter and if you press let's uh, again you invoke the free charges window if you if you don't want to change and you just want to escape this uh, window you just press escape key and this is discount slot here you can just select this cell not this this is all locked just select this cell it will again uh, it will uh, invoke this uh, allow discount window let's say I'm just giving 1.25 uh, percent discount so automatically it will calculate it and you will see this all and this also this words amounts in word is appearing here and GST is here and after that you just press save save this invoice just double click same like a new invoice you just double click save uh, select this cell and then double click so it will again say again a confirmation message I say yes now you will have this window invoice capture successfully so in this way you can create the invoice now if you want to modify some invoice so first you just double click the search suppose I am just looking for some another invoice one one zero one one five so it will fetch one zero one one five and then just modify double click it so now you can modify let's say I don't want uh, this product and I uh, some changes in quantity here and then everything is fine then you just save the modification double click on the done see the done button is not before once you double click the modify it will automatically appear so I just double click the done invoice updated and you will have this insert like uh, this insert is there so you don't want to see the insert so for this you just double double click the search so by default it is it takes from the current uh, invoice so I just say enter so see this all is now perfectly aligned and uh, suppose you want to uh, make changes in the invoice uh, this party name or payment mode you can do it also I just just double click on the modify again see the done is appearing here now I want to change this payment mode so just single click on the payment mode this time I'm selecting check so I'm just checking I'm just modifying modifying this payment mode and suppose I want I wish to change this party also so I just select this invoice to button invoice to sell then I just look for some party select the party just press enter and then escape so it will modify and then say done
so it will be saved in voice update all freeze this is now freeze you cannot change anything sorry this uh, one minute this is freeze basically if you change even then it is not updated in the database and uh, if you wish to print this uh, or, uh, this uh, invoice uh, you can just double click the print button so you will have this uh, print invoice view and then just cancel and it will ask do you want to continue you can uh, press yes but in my case I am press no and suppose you want to convert this invoice into PDF format you just double click uh, click on this PDF this cell I just double click see it will create it, this invoice in the PDF form so this is the beauty of this uh, easy billing system and suppose you wish to print uh, bulk invoices uh, I mean you uh, generate the bulk PDFs of invoices so you just double click this uh, generate bulk invoices I just double click it I'm selecting let's say Z101 3 2 1 0 1 1 6 so I am selecting from this invoice range to this invoice I want PDF then just after giving the range you just press enter so it will creating now it is creating now you can see in the screen see all invoices it will open the folder also once it is done you will have this uh, window uh, with the folder of invoice I mean, this is the invoice folder it automatically it will open by the system so you can have all the invoices from this to this So this is see all invoices are generated whatever you have selected so this is very very beautiful program and this is unique and I am sure this is unique in the Excel based uh, billing system so it will like basically it will create one folder in the D drive and it will generate the invoices uh, within your range and uh, this is product zoom actually suppose you wish to check the someone is come to you and he wants to check some price of the product so you just it will not create the invoice but just for the product view suppose he wants to purchase something uh, before purchasing he wants to check the rate so you can just you can see the stock and rate also selling price so you can check the rate from here without creating new invoice so this is basically product zoom window you just again escape it gone now suppose you wish to delete some invoice for that you just select the invoice first just double click on the search let's say I'm just I want to delete uh, 101 so it is already deleted see you cannot delete this it is already deleted you will have this deleted and deletion date and suppose I'm just deleting some new search let's say <coughs> this 
once you select the invoice then it will ask for the uh, this uh, confirmation once you double click on the delete invoice if you want to delete we just hit this yes otherwise no let's say I say yes so deletion done successfully and this is deleted now see so in this way you can delete the invoice once you delete it so all items again go back to your stock and sale is uh, removed so in this way you can create the invoice with the GST and just go to home this is the button where from where you can go to home your home again same thing this all all stuff is old so in this video I don't want to show you this is sales report so here GST amount now you can search these are the filters you can uh, just apply the filter and see the results this is transaction report this is again same the flow of the items you can see which item is fast moving which is the slowest moving so all items are here this is the product flow report and this is transaction report fully and this is stock entry from here you can just just hit the stock and you will have this window so here you will have all products product name stock selling price cost price and this is the GST so you can change the GST suppose some items having more GST some items having less so you can change from here in this way you can use this easy billing system and the price of this uh, billing system uh, you can find in the under the video description and it's very easy very uh, safe and uh, portable system and uh, people are taking interest in this uh, system and I have already sold many copies of this system and they have they don't have any problem and they are using very well because the PDF and all this stuff is included GST is included so it is very useful so if you have some uh, inquiry or some clarification doubt so you can contact me you will find my detail under this uh, under the description video description so thank you very much for watching my channel and please keep sharing my channel and subscribe my channel thank you very much